when it comes to current color trends, Miller Paint is definitely the place you want to go to. And today I'm with Donna at Miller Paint, and we're on Southeast Grand in Portland. Um, I don't know what the current hot colors are, and you're going to share them with us. Yes, I am. Um, purple mixed with some other colors is a real hot trend right now, and also blues and yellows, warm yellows and blues, just fresh blue and white too. So huh? staying and looking at the purples, how do we match that with, say, wall covering or fabric? The most important thing is start with one thing, Okay. Um, whether it's a wallpaper you love or a fabric you love or it's a piece of china or anything. You've, Find something you're working with and you can work off of that. So is it a shade of purple or just purple in general that's the trend? It's just purples? I think purples in general, as you can see, we go from reddish purples over here, um, more purples with blues, more of an orangey and red purple combination over there. But you know, you can mix and match these all around, okay. even pale lavenders. There's a lot of metallics. Um, a lot of huge pattern okay. in wallpaper, which is great, especially like in powder rooms or dining rooms, special rooms. Um, so, so purple can, can go in any room. That's, it can go in any room. That's good. Absolutely. So, so when people come here, what do they need to bring to you so that it can help in this process? Bring me their ideas. If they have something concrete to bring me, as I say, a plate or a pillow, anything that they love, a piece of artwork, anything that we can kind of pull off of. If they've collected pictures, that's great out of magazines. I can see the look they're trying to get. So are there rules that are hard and fast when we're looking at colors and the matching? I don't think there are rules. I think it's about contrast, light against dark. If a color is not a color, if it's white, it's black, and where do we fit in the middle? Okay. And how do we look against each other? OK. So let's talk a little bit about the blues. OK. You can see all these blues really do work together. I think it's about putting it with a little bit of yellow or white, keeping it happy, keeping it cheery. You know, blue's a classic. I like, I, I think the yellow and the yeah, blue look, it's look very really happy. good together. It makes me happy. And again, this is this is for any room. Any room, any room. Um, you know, people sometimes are afraid of big patterns and crazy things like this. Um, great for a powder room or a little surprise element. You know, you don't have to be plain and boring. Um, color can also go on your ceiling. It's a sixth of your room. Okay. Um, trust your instincts. Have doesn't, fun. Doesn't have to be eggshell white. Absolutely doesn't. not. No. Okay. No. Have fun with stuff. So, last question: How do I finally make my decision? Trust yourself. Trust yourself. Trust yourself. Don't get too many extra opinions. You're the one that lives there. Okay. It's your house. Okay. Well, thanks for sharing these new colors and how to put them together. And I recommend that people come to Miller Paint and get the help because I know I couldn't do this by myself. Yeah, it's fun to do. I love doing it. So come on down to Miller. Great. Thanks, Donna.